Well, I actually decided on the title Grace when I was writing the song. As soon as, as soon as I came up with the, oh, there goes my ring. As soon as I came up with Grace, uh, cheers. As soon as I came up with the, the title, it was like, it was a great follow on to Sanctuary, I thought, because I had the, the idea of calling my album Desire, which is the same, still spiritual, still like Sanctuary. And I loved the, what, the name Desire, but I didn't write a song with Desire in it. <laughs> Well, but you could decide just to not to name the album after, after song. any a song yeah, title. Yeah, it could be. So how yeah. come not Desire and because Grace? Because Gra Grace just fit. It just fit. I mean, Grace was about you know what my the the the, the strength my mother gave me while growing up. Um, you know, teaching me not to follow everybody else. Everybody I know, well, not everyone, but most people I know, you know, went into into street life. You know, guns, drugs. Doing, doing the whole shebang, you know, and, and it was hard not to not to follow because watching other people drive Subarus while you've got a bus ticket, you know, and it's very easy and it's there right there in front of you and you're like, I, I just thought I was destined to do bigger things than just settling for what I could get there and then. But do you and still speak? Grace was a perfect title for me. Do you still speak to those? To my people? Yeah. Hell yeah. My f Listen, man, at the end of the day, they're people. Um, I don't surround myself with them. Um, but my friends, my true friends know that, why I can't. Yeah. You know, because at the end of the day, it's, it's, a lot of the stuff is against the law and I don't want to really be mixed up in that. Okay. And, um, well, Blue, um, were you afraid that, well, Blue would maybe uh, haunt you during your, or starting your career? Um, I, yes, I did. I thought I thought blue was might be a hindrance for me, yeah. because um, you know there's not a lot of solo artists that have come out of boy bands that have made it. You know, Michael Jackson. All right, if I went straight far back, maybe you know Lionel Richie, Commodores. You know, Michael Jackson, Jackson Five. You know, Wham, George Michael. You know, take that, Robbie Williams. You know, and NSYNC, Justin Timberlake. In the history of music, they're the only really real ones that have really made an impact on the, on the industry, and I'm just glad that I've sort of made a little dent on it. You know, it's it, I, haven't, I haven't I haven't made a massive impact yet, but but I'm glad that you know that my music is is, is starting something, and I, and I just know I'm going to get better because I've got so much to offer um, when it comes to the music side of things. But can it be that just thinking now is can it be that because well your music is different from the things you did with Blue. Mm -hmm. That's why you are now, well, starting to... Well, the thing is, is that people don't know, some people don't know that I do No Worries. People don't put this face to the song. They hear it on the radio and they just like the song, but they don't know my name and they don't know my face. So in a way, I've sort of won a battle because yeah. they already like the song. But I haven't won the war yet. You know, I've got to keep coming with those songs. I've got to keep churning them out. And um, I, I feel I have them. You know, in, in my gun belt. And when is it for you then? When, when, when is it for you you have the feeling you have won the war? I th um, when I tour. When I tour and I see people are actually, they've actually come to see me do a show, that's when I think I've won the war. But I'm ready for another battle and another war after that though. <laughs> okay, and what will another battle be for you? The another battle will be another album. Okay. You know, and, and, and creating other songs that people can be like, yep, yeah, he's back. I really like the sound. I like what he's about. He's fresh. And, um, you know, and, and I believe him. Because that's what music's about. You've got to believe what you listen to. And, um, and I believe what I write. And I believe what I sing. So.